It is 7 p.m. in uh, Mumbai, India right now. And about 10 to 12 people that left home this morning to go to college or to work will not go back home this evening. They will die trespassing a railway crossing and get hit by a train. Ten lives finished, the future of ten families altered forever. And we have data about these accidents. The data tells us most of these people are young men aged 15 to 35. They didn't have any physical infirmities that prevented them from crossing safely. And most of these accidents take, take place in broad daylight. Vision was not an issue. And the question is, why? Why, why did you do that? Could you not see the train coming? And the answer, it appears, does not lie in traditional data. The data told us what it could, but if you really needed to understand why those individuals did what they did and how this can be prevented, we needed to go beyond that. We needed to understand and unravel human behavior. And we needed learnings from new fields, neurosciences, behavioral sciences, and that's what we did. It is this combination of data science which tells us what has happened, which can predict what can happen. But when combined with <coughs> cognitive neurosciences, behavioral economics, and non-conscious design, that is when we can really work towards influencing human behavior to drive desired outcomes. 